Gary, a question that comes up too is why does the screw sometimes wobble? What, what, what's that reason? Well, it's not actually the screw wobbling. It's actually the, the tool not being a good fit on the screw. The screws, whether they're Action Fasteners or any other brand, uh, are all made to very good tolerances. The tools sometimes aren't, because they're made by many different manufacturers in um, China and Taiwan and places like that. And if you measure across the flat accurately, you will often find that all three measurements across the fixed flat will be different. So that what happened, and the magnet that goes inside is, not, is in different positions. You may not realise, but you can actually punch that magnet back, uh, put it in a vise, tap it very gently, and punch it back. So, so what you're saying is the magnet is too far forward. Exactly. And anyway, pushing on the head of the screw so you have a large tolerance in the amount you can move. Okay? Now, if it is fitted properly, you take the screw, you put it in there and make sure you're pressing on the washer face head and not on the head of the screw because that damages the head of the screw yeah. with the force that may be in there. Well, what, what if, if you've got a problem with the, the drive not fitting properly on the screw and you're, you're not perhaps near a hardware store um, in some remote area, what can you actually do? about it if you haven't got another drive you've got to work with what you've got yes well you should always carry spare drivers because they do wear away and sometimes people use them when they're when the heck nearly becomes a, a, a round hole mm. however and that's not good because it damages your screw and your coating the um, if you put it in your vice or put it on the ground whatever and you get a hammer and you and a punch and you've always got a punch in your tool bag you'll tap it back and make sure that it fits into and presses on the shoulder of the screw, not on the head. It'll still have the magnetic power there, you, you can have it, but you just punch the, the um, magnet back that little bit. Um, I, I find one in three times on a new drill bit, on a new drive bit, I need to do that to do it properly. Thanks, Gary. It, that's does a, it does apply to all screws, yeah, probably. Okay, that's a great Not tip. Not screws, sorry, to all bits. Yeah. Thanks, Gary. That's a great tip.